early in the sleep cycle, you have got uh, this uh, deep sleep, um, which is restorative for a, for for reasons around inflammation in the brain. The, this lymphatic system, which pumps uh, you know, three times more during that time, is basically anti-inflammatory chemicals for the brain. Mm. I mean, if you go to bed late, that you just miss that cycle, so that doesn't happen. Um, and then as you go through the closer to the seven, six, seven, eight, there's more uh, quantity of dreaming there, which I think is pretty crucial for the rewiring of the brain, the neuroplasticity, moving the postal notes that have been accumulated yeah, yeah. That, that into the right places. Yeah. And if you get up, you don't get this seven or eight hours, and you miss out on that part. So yeah, these are just crucial parts of our biology. Yeah. Um, but I, I think, yeah, my work and others I you know you, you go and do shift work and we've done those studies um, you end up pretty much sucking on everything that you can measure in medicine and psychology compared to people who don't do shift work wow. you know it's it's um, I know we want to keep the country going yeah um, but gosh if you have to choose between shift work and not shift work um, you know it's the, the best you can describe your behavior under shift work is damage control uh, mm-hmm. and and I think you know if, being awake during the day is a crucial thing and being asleep during the night is an important thing. Uh, the other thing is the sort of light mismatch that we talked about. The camping is very matched. So that blue light that's high during the day um, suppresses melatonin and the CB hormone. Um, and then as you get into twilight and there's more red wavelength light, you start to, that comes up and you start to feel sleepy. Of course, um, white LED lights in your home and white LED screens, um, you know, think phones, tablets, have... Um, a really high proportion of blue light, and that's potentially affects us, especially kids. Um, so device use affects quality and quantity of sleep. Um, that, that's a known thing. Uh, 